Hello everyone, it's been a while, <laughs> so welcome yet to another unboxing. As uh, you know, when I saw this, when I saw this advertised, I instantly bought it. <laughs> it was that impulsive, really. It's just because um, I trust the brand, you know, from from um, from them from from their amplifiers. I already trust them, and down to. Um, the Kilburn speaker, the first one, the ki the first Kilburn, and actually I, g I got a pretty good deal for that Kilburn because it comes with this, with a major two Bluetooth that was like maybe two years ago. So I really liked the Kilburn. You know, I liked um, I liked the fact that you could actually um, that you could actually uh, control the uh, the knobs. You know, you can control the treble, the bass, the volume, and stuff like that. With, with with physical knobs, I really like that analog touch to it, and I like the um, the classic uh, design, like it's an amplifier, guitar amplifier, so that's really, really good. And yeah, I really like the sound, especially this, you know, the battery life is really good too. This Major 2 Bluetooth, this this lasts for like, this lasts me for a long, long time. I think, if I'm not mistaken, it's got um, 30 hour playback, but, uh, yeah, so I've been waiting for something really, really portable and just really, you know, small. So what comes in the box is that one I'm going to show you guys. There you go. Yep, comes with the box. Comes with that. Um, yeah, I'm going to take it out so you guys would see. Whew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you look at that? Rock and roll. Set this aside a little bit. Oh, look at that. Oh, beautiful. So I bought it instantly. You know, I'm hoping, I'm really hoping, I have my hopes up that um, I won't be kind of like disappointed with this buy. Just because I really had um, a good experience with, with, um, with the first kill burn and then with the second, uh, what do you call this, with the second major Bluetooth. And so I really have high hopes, maybe, yeah, let's say it, high expectations for this small one right here. So I've never really tried their new lines of, ampli of, of, of amplifiers, <laughs> of their speakers, you know, the, the 3D, the, the, the um, 360 sound. So I've never really tried that. Established 1962. It's <laughs> a nice touch to it. It's got this little thing to make things easier. There you go. Guys can see. Yeah, not gonna be a very good angle here, but let's give it a shot. We've got that paperwork, the usual one, Marshall. Marshall. The black one is really pretty. Set to the side. Here comes the speaker. Oh, it's, it's got a USB cable. What is it? Um. Yeah, it's USB-C. Yeah, it's USB-A. Just really good. So I could charge it, I think, with a power bank. With a battery pack, so it's really handy. So I'm really liking this now because Marshall really has portability in mind when they... Ooh, would you look at that. It's got a nice weight to it. It's, you know, when you kind of like... Um, carry it it doesn't feel cheap in the hand as well this it's got some rubbery feel here too it's got some metal feel here there's no plastic feeling which is really nice you should look at that look at the knobs yeah I don't know if you could see that properly there but there you go the sunlight yeah so let's hope we could turn this on it's got a battery indicator there as well. I don't know if it's working. I think we need to charge it up a little bit. Let's give it a try. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Did you guys hear that? I turned it on and it, this is like some 
scratch, how do you call that, palm mute, palm muted distorted guitar sound just really good. Um, I'm gonna try it now with, with, with the real thing. Let's, let, let's see how it sounds. Of course I don't have the by, I don't know what it's called, the special things for, special microphones for these sound tests, but I just have this normal phone really to do this. Let's see. Let's see, let's see if it's connecting and let's see how easy it would be to detect it. There you go, Emberton, right there. You guys can see. Yep. Emberton. And that's it. It's connected. And that's the, there's the spawn muted again. Palm muted guitar sound, she'll like. Let's go to Spotify. Let's do a rock song. There you go. So there's a sound over here. There's a sound on the back as well. Yeah. Not so bad. Maybe I just have to. That's good. Now let's try a singer song, right? Or a quieter one. Not so bad. Oh, I sound so much better now. I think it's so handy to have that battery indicator right there. From my heart, oh. this confession. It's all rock and full band, it just gives, but I think I just have to just have to mix it properly like that. Hopes and fears, all those years gone by. I was searching you. That's good. I was searching. Control your music here. Next, play. Uh, just press on there to play and pause. You've got the volume up and down there. You've got the forward and rewind there. Previous. I really like it. 
Yeah. Yeah, I don't think, you know, if you if you if you're if you're coming from a bigger speaker like like the Kilburn maybe or something else like the at what's bigger than like <laughs> yeah, the Acton is something else bigger. If you're coming from that, it's going to be really different, especially when you got the rocks on it I played on earlier and we don't have the knobs here, the the, the treble, the bass obviously. So I think, you know, you you have to go through um you ha you have to go to your device to to, to mix it and um, but yeah yeah I'm pretty happy with it you know just for a small room and um, you know maybe when you're on in the park and you don't you know want to disturb many people just a you know fine little speaker with the you know right amount of volume so you won't disturb other people it's really good and I if, if you've heard uh, I don't know if this video would do the the, the audio quality justice but if you've heard the um, um, what do you call that? The uh, the singer songwriter kind of acoustic song feel. It's got a really nice touch to it. It's got the right amount of bass and just right amount of mids to 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 emphasize the vocals. It's really good. Yes, yeah, so I would recommend it. It's really handy too. It's it's so much easy. It's so portable. It'd be very easy to just you know slip in your bag, which is good. Um, yeah, uh, I got it for one hundred twenty nine pounds. Um, I recommend it as always. See that design is just timeless, wonderful grill, metal there, steel. So I like it. I like it. Good job again, Marshall. For a speaker this small and the price tag, it's 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 not bad at all for me. It's not bad at all. And yeah, I really like the design. And I, I've heard it's waterproof as well somehow. So you got that twenty hours of portable playtime right there. Yeah. And yeah, if you can see the, 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 the advertisement here too, it's got splashes of water there. So it's somehow water resistant rating IPX7. Yeah, so it's, you know, really good for the summer if you want to go to the beach, but not with the current situation. <laughs> uh, yeah, IPX7 water resistant design. So it's really good. I like it. I really like it. Well, that's it for me. That's it for this video. So thanks for watching guys till the next unboxing and very amateur review. <laughs> Cheers.